Hi, this is James Ward, a developer evangelist at Heroku. So JetBrains has released a new early access program for the IntelliJ IDEA 11 product that now supports Play Framework. So I wanted to show you how we can get start using uh, the Play Framework support in IntelliJ. So let's go create a new application with Play. And let's go into that. And now I can just do the Play IDEA. And now it's actually created a new module for me that now I can use in IntelliJ. So let's go over into IntelliJ. This is using the uh, 110.187 release. And I'm going to go create a new project. And I'm going to just say create this from scratch. And now I'll go in and point it to that directory that I specified. So let's go specify that desktop foo directory there. And now I'm not going to tell it to create a module, so I'm going to deselect that option there. So now this will create the new project in IntelliJ. And it's going to pop up this dialog to, to add a new module. I'm going to cancel that because I'm actually going to import the module uh, in here. So uh, let's go to um, new module. And then I'm going to say import from external model or sorry, import existing module, there we go, that IML file, and I'm going to select that foo.iml file there that was created from play, and then just hit finish. So now my project's all set up in IntelliJ, and that looks good, but in order to actually now use uh, the play support, I can just go to tools, and then play with play framework, and so now, uh, once this finishes indexing this project, we'll get the, the play support button down here. So now I have the play console here within IntelliJ. In order to get that to work on Linux, for some reason I had to make a, a small change to IntelliJ. It was looking for a, uh, a file in my play directory. Uh, it was looking for play.sh, and all I had was a play file. So what I did was I, I symlinked the file. So if we take a look at play.sh, that's just symlinked to the play file there. So it's one small change I had to make to get that working. Uh, but now everything should should work just normally with Play. I can do Play Run. Now my application is is up and running uh, and can go in and, of course, make uh, changes to uh, to all the code in this project and, and uh, be up and running here in IntelliJ. So you can see they've even added some support here uh, where you can navigate straight to the view from, uh, from one of the uh, static uh, methods in a controller. So really, uh, really great that IntelliJ is now supporting Play Framework, and that's how you get set up and uh, start using it. Thanks for watching.